And we're good. Hello, guys. Happy Monday. Hey, guys. Happy Monday. Or is it a happy Monday? Pretty shitty Monday. It's never happy on Mondays. <laughs> well, if the week continues to go as it did today for me, it's going to be another shit show at work. <clears throat> so, I'm sure I'll get into it. But, uh, first and foremost, dinner time. Cheese fries. Alright, I got my cheese sauce, french fries, and then BLTs. Your classic BLTs with a, uh, a crunch. The best chips ever. <laughs> Those are like some of my favorite chips. They're okay. You never see me go like bonkers over chips. But I love those chips. I know you do. We'll see how much I uh, eat today. I didn't eat nothing today, but it's the weirdest thing. When I have a very busy day, a very... Um, Hello, Abby. How you doing, girl? Hello. What's up, David? Hello, Abby. Uh, Hello, when I have David. one of those days where I'm just I'm very busy and I work up an appetite, when it comes time to eat, I don't have an appetite. I don't know why. I really don't. But that's what I got tonight. And then Keki's got a uh, shrimp salad. So I have a Mexican street corn shrimp salad that I topped with some avocado and some of my homemade pico de gallo. Ugh. I cannot uh, wait to eat this sucker. Yeah. She's like, I'm trying your BLTs. I'm like, more than... It's like, I'm trying more. your BLTs, but I can't wait to eat this. I'm like, good. This looks so freaking good. I'm good with it. Don't wait for me. Do not wait for me. Hello, Jamie. How are you? Hello, Jamie. Hi, Melissa. Hello, Melissa. How you doing, girl? Oh, God. Yeah, I came home from... I got home. Kagi picked me up at uh, 7.30 from work. 7.30. 7.30, I got off of work. Uh, I had to make two pit stops. One to the grocery store to get tonight's dinner. And then the other was to... was like a personal errand. So by the time I got home, I immediately changed, and on the road I went for my run. Hello, Terry. Hello, Jamie. Hello, Hello Terry. Clinton. Hello, Clinton. So it was it was go 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 today for me, but I like I like days like that. I mean, I didn't get to see the kids a whole lot for more than probably half an hour. The son was sleeping by the time I got out of the shower. The daughter was already bed when I when I got home from my run. So it's just been. Me and Kaki the whole night since yeah. nine forty-five. Um, so yeah, I'm praying. I seem to jinx myself every time I say this. I'm praying for a better day tomorrow. You're my spirit animal. Well, thank you very much. A lot of people say that. A lot of people say that. Hello, good evening. I don't know who said that one. Mo who's that? Oh, Terry said that. I said hello to you already. Good. Just, I try not to go over comments. I try to catch them all. Unless they're rude. Then I, I usually ignore Yeah, them. then we ignore those. Why didn't you toast the bread? Duke of Arkansas. I never toast my bread. What's up, Grim? Ah, you should know better. We don't do recordings, brother. We're live every single Is night. Is this a recording? Then why the heck would you click on the live, dude? Come on. Mm -mm. Some people actually do post recordings and then they and it shows up as being live. Really? How the hell they do they like I've seen The Rock's Instagram. See, that's weird. So The Rock did a live and it was him eating French toast and people screen recorded it and then they could actually post it as their live video. How they do it, I don't know. What's up, Jimmy? I didn't see Raw tonight. I caught the very ending of Cody getting a beat down, but um yeah, it's going to be good. I'm liking where they're going. Graham said that was funny. Because <laughs> I was just about to be like, Graham, really? <laughs> <sighs> you know we're alive every single night. Uh, You're here. Hello, Pink time. Dazer. What are you famous for? I'm not famous. Do you eat just once a day? I do. During the week, yeah. Third favorite active wrestler? Um... Cody and Roman are my number one and two. And my third favorite? Who do I enjoy watching? I like Seth Rollins a lot. I know. He's, I'm, he's, start, he's starting to grow on uh, me. Jesse's girl said she can't see me. I'll fix it. Hello, Marks. How are you? How often do you eat? Once a day, yes. Once a day. Except the weekends. Then I'm a guardian. Except for family. the weekends for Jamie, not for me. Yeah. No, khakis usually go on the weekends. 
But um, I'm usually good all the time. Yeah, I'm the one that's like a human garbage pail on the weekends. Oh, cooking Testinos right now, very nice. Where'd we meet? Karaoke. What's There's up, Albert? There's beautiful tacky. Oh, thank you, Texas girl. Appreciate that. You can't choose yourself, Rollins. So say MJF. I'll be honest with you, Seth Rollins. Beautiful South, thank you, my is gro He's delicious. growing on me. <laughs> I like it when he's serious. I don't like the goofball Seth Rollins, but when he's serious, like he's been, I like it. I dig it. <clears throat> Hello, Gina Bunks. Up, it's Marks? been a long time, girl. How you been? You have to eat more than once a day. I'd be so hungry. No, if you're busy. Your mind's not on food. You don't worry about food. Yeah. Hello, Nancy. <clears throat> Trust me. My mind is always on food, but I don't have time to eat. Who's costing Roman the title at WrestleMania? Hello, Nancy. How you doing, girl? I think everybody is expecting... There's no pasta here. Everybody's expecting The Rock to turn on Roman. I don't see that happening. I see Rock and Roman at SummerSlam. I mean, I'm, I see Rock and Cody at SummerSlam. I see The Rock continuing to be the bad guy for a while. You should make double-sized pizza again. Double-sided pizza again. It's coming. I got an idea. All Are right. you eating a salad? Yes, I am. Mm. I am eating a salad, not Jamie. One to ten, where am I going with these BLTs? Dean Ambrose shows up? No. No, 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 no. Here we go. Okie dokie. What do you think I'm going to rate it? I don't know. I want to say it's going to be at least neat. At least neat. Cabin napping. Oh, baby. And I honestly want to try it because of the sauce you put on there. I was like, that sauce smelled so damn good. Been working 16 hour days at the post office. At the here. post office? Oh, man. Jamie, Jim Cornette would die of a stroke. If what? Is that keto bread? It is, yeah. It's 647 potato bread. Hey, you pick it up whenever you're ready. This is good. You don't gotta tell me twice. I'm, I know. <laughs> you like how Punk uh, gave uh, Jim Cornette a little bit of a shout out tonight about the podcast? Did you make like a double sack? What are you talking about? You. I just put it down there. No. Oh. I was just like, oh my god, that's a big ass sandwich. Oh, if Moxley showed up, yeah. But you know what? If Moxley did show up, let's just say, let's play a game. Let's say he did show up. Um, he would be produced the right way, not left to his own devices and do what he, you know, and do what he wants like he's doing now. Oh, that's good. It's very good. Oh my God. For me, the bread needs to be toasted, but no, it's I your dinner. I, I, it's I, your dinner. Like, if that was my dinner, I would have toasted the bread. Yeah, no. I like the soft bread. Mm. That's good, though. Really good. Yeah, I love the keto bread. Marks, the 647, they make keto like everything. They make Kaiser rolls. They make Hero rolls. They make everything. And it's lower calorie, and it tastes good. How's your salad? Oh, my salad is freaking phenomenal. What's up, Harlem? Fasting? Yep. Sushi with a question mark. We haven't done sushi mm. in a long time. It's been a while. I would love to go to sushi. I think what I'm going to do is me and Kagi might be making a little trip for a collaboration. And we're going to try to make it like a weekend thing, like a Saturday into Sunday. Maybe me and Kagi will do a sushi... Uh, a, I don't get your hopes up for this because I don't know how we would be able the to do it. The only way I'm it. doing sushi is if I'm going to our sushi place. I know. I know. I'm not going to a new sushi place. I can't. No. Do that and then we stay out there. 
You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. We plan something, do it that way. I don't know when. Me and Kenki haven't had a night away in like a month. Since my birthday. Almost a month. Yeah. We have some bills to pay, including rent. So as long as I could be on time. Oh, hello, my milk. How you doing, my girl? As long as I could be on time with paying the bills. Um, what are we at? Oh, shit. We're at the end of the... I'm, I'm going to be a little late for rent, but after that, I think uh, we should be good for possibly second week of April. Indian food. Oh my goodness. I love Indian food. I love Indian food. Rent too. is overrated. Yeah. Tell me about it. Tell the landlord that. How much is rent, Clinton? We don't discuss We're that. not going into that. And honestly, it's none of your business. So don't ask. Hey, no need to be... Uh, I'm just saying, that's being nosy. I'm, aren't you curious about how much people pay for rent with different places? Cl uh, yeah, but I'm not going to go... not in New York. But I, I know, but I'm not going to go asking somebody how much they pay for rent. That's that's kind of rude. Fuck, Clinton, how much do you make? How much do you pay for rent? Yeah. If you tell me, I'll tell you, okay? <laughs> just curious. Clinton, I know you're not being rude, bro. Yeah, no, it's I'm just good. saying. I'm just saying. I would never ask somebody how much you pay for rent. I would never do that. Why? Just because it's kind of rude. I think if it's like... No, it's kind of rude. I know Clinton wasn't trying to be rude. He was just being curious. I get it. I'm just saying. I would never ask somebody that question. Six ninety five. Okay, you're cheaper than us. What's up, Matthew? <laughs> Put it this way. A one-bedroom apartment... Six ninety five. On Long yeah. Island, it's hard to find under two thousand. Yeah. Now, me and Kaki are very fortunate and very lucky to live at home. Uh, doesn't mean we don't pay rent. We got kids and we got bills, and the show that we do is not cheap. Six ninety five is free. That's a good deal, depending on what you have for it. I think a lot of people would four thousand dollars in Manhattan. See, yeah, that's crazy, and he probably well, yeah, in, in Manhattan. <laughs> Bah, 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 bah. And I guarantee you probably have like a room, maybe with a toilet, possibly a hot plate, <laughs> <laughs> and maybe a bed. <laughs> I've been watching a lot of videos. Now this is not my case. I have a, I have a kids. I have got a khaki. Um, I can't have the luxury of buying a nice van. And turning it into like one of those uh, mobile homes on wheels. I think if I was a single man, I would 100% do that. Even if it was just me and Khaki. I could see us living in like a, a big van. Like a minimalist life. Yeah, I could see that too. If it was just me and you, no kids, absolutely. Jamie, did you make up for Khaki's birthday? No. First of all, he doesn't need to make up for my birthday. There's no need for Jamie to make up for my birthday. I had a great birthday. I had fun. I had a good time. I think they're talking about the dinner mishap. Where oh, I, the dinner? Yeah, well. Where I returned. Oh, yeah, the, no. The, I next, re, I the re, next day, I ordered my own dinner. I returned khaki. Along with the margarita. Chicken so. sandwiches. It <laughs> <laughs> was a fun night, though. It was a fun night. It was a very fun I night. I got so much shit, so many messages. <laughs> Why couldn't you just let her eat her chicken sandwiches? Why'd you have to be a pig and order... All those Big Macs. And I swear to you, I wasn't thinking. I figured we'd both eat Big Macs and fries. You know I don't like Big Macs or their fries. <laughs> but it's fine. It doesn't matter. That's water under the bridge. It doesn't matter. I ordered myself a wonderful dinner the next night, along with the margarita. So I was good. I was good to go. Wisconsin, three bedroom is a... What's up, Mary? Very high in California. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Do you remember that? Depends on it. Yeah, Long Island's cost of living is probably the same as California. To be honest, it's probably the same damn thing. Super goddamn expensive.
Oh. Um, Brent asking isn't rude. I agree, Munchkin. I ask all the time. I'm curious, lol. If people don't want to say, then I respect it. Jamie, <clears throat> Jamie, if AEW and WWE both wanted to sign you for the same amount, who would you rather work for? AEW get paid to do nothing, or WWE work more and be more famous than no? Um. I act like this is such a possibility, and it's not. I'll never be signed to either company, but I probably would sign with AEW. I probably would sign with AEW. Yeah, I don't see you ever signing with WWE. I ain't signing with nobody. Well, no, I don't wrestle you, no more. If you had the choice, I don't see you doing that. I only say AEW because um, the schedule is a lot lighter. And if you're a family man, which I am, I would be home with my family more. WWE, you're on the road and you're grinding. And if you're not on the road wrestling, you're doing something else. Um, schedule reasons alone, um, AEW. If I wasn't a family man and I was a single... Uh, person, I would probably go with WWE. Where do we reside in? New York. Yeah, we live in New York. The expense capital of the world. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, Jamie Curley? Listen, there's so many Jamies that. And John, I see you. What's up, bud? Hello, John. Yeah, there's a lot of Jamies in here. I always get mixed up on which Jamie I'm saying hello to. Well, this is a new Jamie. Jamie Curley. Hi, Jamie Curley. Hey, Albert, which one can you see me in? Let's just say yeah, I was still wrestling. Where could you see me? What is a better brand that fits me, you think? I got cold all of a sudden. I'm not eating all four of these sandwiches. I knew that was going to be the case. I kind of knew that was going to be the case, too. It's like when I really work hard on top of me coming home and then running, and it's go, 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 and it's nothing in my system, I don't have an appetite. Merritt's Grill has the best BLT in North Carolina. Chapel Hill. Chapel Hill. North Carolina. I'd like to see you in NXT selling your soul out to Braun Breaker. <laughs> yeah, he. Yeah. NXT. I don't a very, even know who that is. No. Uh, I, I, you, NXT is a very hard show to watch for me. Bye. Uh, but wrestling be a booming. Can't deny that one. Hey, stop that. The one thing I don't like about the bread, it's hard for me to talk as I usually do. Because it mouth. sticks to my roof of my mouth. Yeah. It's not toasted. Even if it's not like, you just need like a little slight like something to it, so it's not like. I don't. So... I don't like. To, I li I like it soft. It, <clears throat> it tastes better that way. Stop it. I give you a French fry, but that's it. You gotta go away now. <clears throat> Excuse me. You gotta go away now. I'm trying to think if I should cut it in half. This might be one of the best BLTs I've ever made, though. It was really good. The chips on there definitely made it. Can you watch him? Because he's being a little... Yep. <laughs> Melissa said, I want a BLT. <laughs> I like it soft. Isn't something people usually say. <laughs> well, when it comes to bread, sure, I like it soft. Just saying.
I got my eye on you. I do. Talking about penises again? <laughs> Seems like we talk about that a lot. <laughs> yeah, well. Honestly, I don't see much longer. No, Albert, no. No, Jamie. they're gonna do. They're gonna. They're gonna do good. They're getting mm -hmm. there. I have. I have faith in it. <sighs> do you guys have a local bread shop around you, fresh made, Jamie and Kagi? No. 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 Jamie, you just gotta be tag team with Macho Man. LOL. Bull said, "Oh yeah." Yeah, I can't do the oh yeah, but I know you can do the oh yeah. Sometimes I could do the oh yeah. He took my napkin. That son of a biscuit. Fake? What's fake? Yeah, what's fake? Maybe he didn't take the napkin. Kaki, what's your best tasting cake? What was my best tasting cake? No. I want to say no. my best tasting cake was like the Little Mermaid cake that I made for our daughter like a couple years back. Both birthplace mm. or both of you? Um, a couple years back, it was a strawberry cake with vanilla frosting. National County, I'll say that. I was born in Westchester. Thank you, Zach. I'm not going to get... You were born in Westchester? Yeah. New York? Yeah. Upstate? Yeah. What? Oh, my God. Were you born in Westchester? Go on. Oh. oh, my God. <laughs> Are we really telling people the towns that we're born in? I said Nassau County. <laughs> <coughs> I was born in Lake Onawana. I didn't know you were going with that. <laughs> People trying to find information out about us. You're What's like, up, yeah, I'm born in here. I'm like, I'm not telling you where I'm born. Duh. <laughs> <laughs> well, shit. Sorry, Louise. <laughs> no up, offense, Jesus? Louise. I'm just saying I'm not telling you where I was born. Oh, lucky you're being a pain in the butt tonight. Hello, Shirley. How you doing, girl? <sighs> I was born at the Federal Reserve in Houston. Well, I was born in a hospital. <laughs> Torch I'm not going to disclose. I was born in New York, and then I bounced back and forth from Atlanta to New York. Um, there you go, Albert. That's the perfect, <laughs> perfect answer. <laughs> Albert, I don't know why I didn't think of that. What's up, Cortland? But I wouldn't say that. <laughs> Hello, Shelly. Shelly, yes. Hello, Cortland. Kagi, how are you feeling? I'm feeling better. I'm so low congested, my ears are so clogged. But other than that, I'm good. I'm fine. Thank you for asking, Shelly. I appreciate that. Stop it. Here, more french fry? Stop feeding him. I just threw a french fry. He's so crazy, he didn't even see it. I'm gonna have to block block Lucky away. Yeah, Lucky's like going a little nuts though. I'm gonna I'm not doing both sandwiches. <clears throat> I would rather. Let me ask you a question. I did something very different this morning. You know how when you go to sleep at night, mm -hmm. you have a certain position you like to sleep yes. in. I have to be like hugging my pillow and comfortable. Yes. 
Okay, so you know how I go to sleep every single night, mm -hmm. right? Head at the bottom towards the iPad. I got up at five o'clock this morning, and instead of getting up and going into work early, like I wanted to do, I wound up turning towards, uh, basically uh, towards Kagi, and then bundled myself in the blanket, went all the way in the middle of the crack of the bed, fell right to sleep. I said, fuck this. Not only am I going back to sleep, but I'm going to go to sleep like this tonight, and I'm going to put the iPad in the middle of our bed mm -hmm. and go to sleep that way. And we had no little one on our bed this morning. I know. I was so excited was when nice. I got up this morning. Because normally once she crawls in, I wake up. You're going to buy a cam in. Instant, like, wake up. Because she, like, likes to lay on top of me, and then I can't sleep. Jamie, your Instagram is getting crazy. The yes, it is. The crack me up. I know. I just, <laughs> I can't believe I hit 50,000. When Jamie was telling me about some of the comments, I started laughing. Someone said you're like Nikki Six, but only if you like vitamins and exercise instead of heroin. <laughs> Oh my wow. What a compliment. Hello, Monica. Hello, Monica. How you doing, girl? I pad in the bed. Well, it usually goes on my. Usually goes on his, like, nightstand. My nightstand. And I'll go to sleep at falling, you know. I'll fall asleep watching wrestling until the battery dies. And then, like, once it's out, it's out. Um. And by the time we're done streaming on this thing, it's at like 40%, so it doesn't it doesn't really last long. Hello, Mr. Jimmy Jim. Hello, Day Mr. one Jim. of no pizza. In your face, khaki dude. Jamie showed you a strut or stuff, Jamie. Do your victory in your face dance. Hip thrust. Serve it in the it's, face and all. <laughs> it's been one day, sir. It's been one day. We'll see what happens once Friday hits. <laughs> Jimmy Jam, I um I messaged you back about your wrong answer you gave me about Tiffany Stratton. I asked Jimmy Jam. We'll I said, talk on Friday, Jimmy Jam. We'll I said, talk on Friday. You get one guess. <laughs> Who's my favorite girl right now on WWE TV? And I said I even gave uh I gave him a hint. I said she's on the blue brand. Anybody that likes wrestling can chime in. I'm wondering if anybody will get it. I doubt it. But let's see. Jimmy Jam is the only one that knows. I have no idea. You Well, you saw her. It doesn't mean I know who you're talking about. What's been your favorite thing you've made food-wise in your videos? Um, I made, um, I made a buffalo chicken cheese fries pizza slice. I've made some pretty damn good hot dogs. Uh, one with Ritz comes to mind. Uh, my homemade pizza uh, last year was really good. Uh, I'm watching a guy make a sandwich, Italian mortadella. Mortadella. You can finish Pistachio that spread on a flatbed that took forever to make. But it looks so good. I'm trying to find it. Mm -hmm. Trying to find it made somewhere in town. I'm not a fan of mortadella. Not I don't a fan. even know what it is. Mortadella, it's Marie? like mortadella is like Italian bologna. It comes with like chunks of fat and like bologna. That's like it's a like a giant. Deal. No, no, no. It's like a giant bologna, and it comes with like pistachios and like chunks of fat. So when you slice it, there's like I don't know all different types of shit in there. Anyway, if you're watching this tomorrow... I used to slice it at work all the time back when I worked in a deli. And you're wondering, Jamie never said who is his favorite, I guess, lady wrestler in WWE right now. Hi, Lisa Marie. How you doing, girl? Dakota Kai. No, stop That's it. how it looks with khaki. Looks like, like, yeah, my God, Melissa the South is so damn good. What's up, Charles? You mix. You're, you're mixing, mixing up olive. No, I am not. Mortadella has pistachios in it. Olive loaf has olives in it. That's why they call it olive loaf. Do you want to talk about head cheese? Let's talk about head cheese and what's in head cheese. That's disgusting. What are we talking about head? <laughs> Do you watch any UFC? Not anymore, Garrett. We used to. 
we don't watch it no more. You want to hear something funny though? John Fitch actually commented on one of my videos last week. I thought that was uh, <laughs> I thought that was funny. Do you watch any UFC? We used to, Garrett. Not anymore. It's been years Dude, since stop. we watched UFC. I'm not giving you no more. No, you're being rude. Between the two of you, Running Man. Listen, Jimmy can't dance, so it wouldn't even be fair. Who said that? I would just win. <laughs> Who says I can't dance? <laughs> I can dance. I just mortadella chew. has pistachios in it. Yes, yeah, certain mortadellas have pistachios in it. Hey, thank you for thank you for the gift. Thank you. Simone says up, you're correct because he, he works in the deli meat department. I know I'm correct, my milk, because I worked in the deli department for. 15 years of my life, I know damn well about slicing. Mortadella has pistachios in it and chunks of fat. I worked with Gorse Head, so <laughs> I kind of think I know what I'm talking about. Favorite Disney princess? Mm -hmm. Um, does anybody want to? Thank you for thank you, Ramon, for confirming what I already knew. But thank you for your support. I appreciate it. <laughs> Does anybody want to take a guess on my favorite Disney princess? Kaki, do you know? Hmm. I don't think that I do know your favorite Disney princess. I don't think you know mine either. This is something we've never discussed. Favorite Disney princesses. Well, I have one. I'll get Munchkin already guessed. Let's see if anybody else has got any guesses. Snow White. Mm -mm. I don't know. I have no idea. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get one more guess, and then favorite Disney princess, Lisa Marie. I didn't know Jamie had a favorite Disney princess. Of course I do. Honest. Cinderella. Munchkin said Ariel. Lisa Marie says Cinderella. Well, I know mine. Do you know mine? Ariel. Yeah, and you don't know mine. Belle. I was going to say that. <laughs> I was going to say that. Because beauty loves the beast. <laughs> Jasmine? No, Belle. 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 Beauty and the beast. Who the fuck is Mona? Moana. <laughs> oh, Moana. <laughs> it's Moana. <laughs> I don't know who Moana is. I've never watched that movie, to be honest. That's way after my Disney times. Yeah. I think Toy Story. Uh, I don't think Toy Story is Disney. No, it's Pixar. The last Disney movie that I watched was Encanto. Which I love that movie, by the, the way. I thought that was a great movie. I loved Encanto because we don't talk about Bruno. Mm -mm. Do we watch the new Lost Busters? Not yet. Not yet, but I want to see the new Ghostbusters. I'm really excited for it. I like said to our son, I'm like, oh, let's go see the new Ghostbusters. He's like, no, I want to go see that with Uncle. I'm like, all right, I guess I'll go see it by myself. Do you want to go see the new Ghostbusters? I want to go see it. I didn't see the first one. That's true, you didn't. Yeah. I, I guess I'm going alone. I didn't see the first one. Or at least I'm going to watch it when it's streaming. It's fine. I'll just wait until it's streaming somewhere. Moana, a.k.a. The Rock. Yeah, The Rock's in Moana. <laughs> oh, really? <laughs> Are you excited for WrestleMania? Yes, I am. <sighs> Yeah, I've seen the original Ghostbusters. I watched all the original Ghostbusters. 
What child of the 80s and 90s hasn't seen the original Ghostbusters? I just wait for everything to stream. You hate the theater. See, I like the theater court. I like the theater. But I don't like going alone. I don't go by myself. I feel like that's just weird. I remember. I can't do it. So here's a story. When I was little, I actually saw Ghostbusters in the theaters. And we had to leave once the man in the painting came alive because my little brother got scared. Really? It's so good in my mouth? <sighs> Alright, well, you know what? I'm going to see it. All by myself. I don't care. What's up, Price Maker? Are you going to watch the... Ray, Ray Wyatt documentary on Peacock? Yeah, I kind of cried a little bit seeing the trailer. <clears throat> I showed Khaki as soon as I got off yeah. of work. She picked me up. I kind of want to watch it, too. I'm 100% watching it. I taped, um... I'll watch it with you if you want. No. No? Nope. Alright. I guess I'll fuck myself. No. If something I know I'm going to be emotionally watching, I want to watch it by myself. Hey, nothing against you. I understand you. that. I get it. But watching the trailer, I got emotional, you know, watching it. And stuff like that. Um... You know, Jimmy Jam, shut up. <laughs> He's waited for me. Have you seen me with my hair down? Roar! I feel it's too. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. He can wait for you. Roar! <laughs> Real man got feelings. Yeah, and you know, Bra when That's Bray Wyatt fine. passed he away, in front of me, I get it. first off, out of you know, me and Khaki's been together a long time. Bray Wyatt. 18 years. When Bray Wyatt passed away, that hit me. That, that you know, that it was a very, uh... It was a shock. Yeah, that is, It was a um, huge shock. I would Ow. rather, I would rather watch it by myself. Your sister is beautiful. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Uh, Bray Wyatt, John, wrestling. Oh my god. You know, my mom, I taped up, uh, I taped last night's British Bulldog documentary. And then I also taped the Bret Hart one because I didn't see it. My mom watched the Bret Hart one today and she cried. I mean, they got into the Owen Hart part. I literally <clears throat> came home from my walk. And Jamie's mom just sitting here, like, watching the TV in the back. And she's crying and she's crying. She's like, they're talking about Owen. And yeah. I was just like, oh. Yeah, when Owen Hart passed away, that hit me, my mom, and my brother very hard and then my dad stopped watching wrestling the night he tragically fell <clears throat> so you know April 1st is the documentary for Bray where's the pizza Ghostbusters Afterlight made me cry if you know you know yeah I got teary eyed at the end of it to be honest for who uh, the Ghostbusters Afterlight yeah. because of you didn't watch it, so I can't tell you. No, but I know, like, Egon died in real life, and they did, like, a thing for him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I knew that. I just didn't see it. I don't know the cast. One of the dogs has something. I'll be right back. I, I'm good to go when you are. I'm going to go, too. I'm done eating my salad. This is, like, one of the best salads I've ever made. Oh, my God. I didn't think I was going to eat all of this. Ugh. But now I know I'm going to feel like crap tomorrow at work. Mm -hmm. When I watch Hallmark commercials, I cry at anything. Court, I will tell you right now, I cry at like, those commercials about dogs and stuff. The animals that have no homes, I literally sit there and cry. So does our daughter, and she's just like, Mommy, can we just send them some money? I'm like, oh my god, no. <laughs> That's not My milk, what was what and salad then, did you yeah. make? So it was a Mexican street corn salad that I added my homemade pico de gallo to, and then I made some shrimp, and that was it. So good. I did, Jimmy, I was I did read you about Bra, uh, what you said about Bray, about a phenomenal booker. Uh huh. Can't watch that. I can't watch the animal commercials either. They make me cry. Speaking of commercials, Trisha sent me the actual personal page of that commercial that I love so much. Oh, the Ozempic? 
She's like, this is her personal page. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's wrap it up, uh, guys. Excuse me. We so will sorry. see you tomorrow. Um, thank you for hanging out with us. Thank you for supporting us. Yes, thank you. It really thank does you all so much. It, we appreciate really, it. it it really does mean the world. Um, <laughs> when you guys hey. message us and you keep us company hey, for dinner, stop it. it's very fun. I look forward to doing this every single night. And those of you that enjoy watching us, I hope you do the same. So, Jamie, one of your best headbands tonight. This one? Oh my goodness! This was uh, this Macho Man you headband. Up, yeah. Creeper. Thank you, Jimmy. <laughs> I think I've only worn it one time. Yeah, this I remember you one? making it. I remember making it too, um, but I only wore it one time. <coughs> you have so many. I've got over two hundred of them. <coughs> so. Hey, you know what? They're for sale, too. So if anybody wants to buy one, just shoot me a message. I will sell it to you. They are for With sale. With the exception of a few of them that I, I can't seem to let go. But good night, guys. Have a good night, guys. Ah!